Hello and welcome to episode 8 of Medieval Dynasty. So, where I left it, quite literally in this spot, oh, no, there we go, in this spot, and this kind of horrible, wet, dreary weather, is we've got a ton of fertilizer, and I will see you back at my place. So yeah, bear with. And I'll do a proper introduction to the episode then. So yeah, here we are back after a very, very slow walk. An extremely slow walk to here. Where I'm going to drop off the uh, fertilizer. Uh, yeah, I'm going to drop off a fertilizer. Because it's late in the day, so um, I want to drop off 50 fertilizer, which leaves us with 25. Um, yeah, da, da, da. Uh, we need to get a hoe. Can we get a stone? Well, uh, well, there's only one stone hoe. I feel bad if I use. Oh, bloody hell, it's gone for a lot of. Oh no, wait, wooden hoes, there we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do is make a, load, a couple of simple bags. But we already have a bag anyway, and let's put the hoe in number three. And uh, what's it? Bag is five. Change it to fertilizer. And which one was my carrot? Beetroot, cabbage, flax, carrots. Oh, he hasn't even completely hoed it yet. Didn't even finish that. We definitely need to get some more farmers by the looks of it. Oh, that's... Which, what has he not done? Which one is he not done? Oh, that's going to annoy. No, no, I don't know. Which one hasn't he done? I am thoroughly confused. Is it out one? I'm really confused. Carrots. There we go. Is that them all done now? Uh, what am I doing? There we go, carrots. There we go. Okay, now, I don't think you can see a huge amount. But can I have... Yeah, I can. No. So, I'm just going to have to do this in the dark. Wow. They all sleep. Because as soon as they wake up, they're going to start putting the fertilizer on whichever is the closest field, I think. Um, and I can't be having that. Um, so I need to do this myself. Which means you can not be able to see anything. Yes, yeah, so um, I'll see you in a bit. Well, I made a cock up in the dark, not being able to see. I have managed to fertilize three parts of the onion field, which was next to the uh, carrot field. A little embarrassing, 
Let's look. We've missed out three here. And as you can see, we started doing three of the onion field. So I need to figure out which ones we've, I've missed in this carrot field. Okay, so. Da 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 da. Um, there. That one. It's definitely carrot. And then it's this one here, I believe. And then, whoop, there. So now that should be completely done. Why do I keep going on a journal? Carrots. Carrots are now completely done. So I need to now hoe it up. This is so difficult. Okay, so I've hoed this one two, three, four, five. Did that one? Onions, carrots. So, boom. one, two, three, four, five onions. One, two, three, four. Oops, too early. Five. One. This is riveting, I know. Especially as you can't see anything. <laughs> I will go to sleep after this, don't worry. Nope, that's onions. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. So I missed that one. And any more? No. No, it's all. All fertilized, all ploughed up, all ready for seed in the winter. Or not. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Useless I am. Useless. Two, three, four, five. Now is that everything? Carrots. Yeah, okay, that's it. I'm heading to bed now. And we'll, I will see you in the new season where it's going to be winter. We're going to need a lot of firewood. I'm going to pick up the traps as well. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a lot of firewood. So, oh, there we go. There's a the transition. And we're magically back in our house. And we need to warm up. Because it is cold. So I need to wander around with uh, with my torch. Which means I think we're going to have to make some more torches. So, yeah, I know, I know about the temperature. It's cold, it's winter. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so... Let's go in here, let's put this away, these away, uh, simple bags away, sticks away. Actually, no, we kind of need sticks anyway, don't we? Um, yeah, so we need some sticks, so we're going to take those. And, oh, we need straw. How are we doing on logs? We've got 28 logs. Let's turn 20 of them into firewood. Just to keep us going. And, um, yeah, because our, our people are going to be cold otherwise. And we need to go and pick up some more straw if we're going to make some more of these torches. I don't think we actually get cold from being in the water, which is good. 
otherwise would be screwed because we just need to um, get all these reads the other thing is we need to go and save that person because it, it must be awful being injured and just stuck there by the water in this weather do not MVM whatsoever in, uh, whatsoever whatsoever so in the winter you basically need to keep warm by keeping your um, your torch out which is a bit of a pain unless you can afford um, some nice woolen clothes I think you do get woolen clothes at some point from a quest though. Uh, it might be one of Unigos, I want to say. Um, look, Q, and how many torches can we make? Let's make six. And only we've got to put our torch away to make them more torches. But oh well, at least we'll have some torches now. And we can go and put the rest of the straw away. Um, let's have a quick look at it. We've got 33 straw. We could do some more. Um, how are we doing for logs? We've only got 8. Got plenty of planks. Got 10 simple bags. Got 84 stone. We might actually be able to make a stone house. So I think it's six logs, isn't it, to make a house? And we do want to get um, the other bloke from Rolnica. And if we need to go over to Rolnica anyway, wouldn't it be a great uh, thing to do to come back with uh, another bloke? So yeah, here we go. Let's uh, build uh, the house. Um, line it up. Dum dum dum. Give him a little bit of space, and boom. Nice. Now, um, hammer. What we want to do is actually, where's it? That door. That door's over there. That one's there. Yeah. So this one's fine. Door, let's turn it into stone because you need six stone for that. We can make a stone house, which we could then move one of our current um, people into. Because that will be better than just having the one person in it. And we could actually do that one. Yeah, 24 planks. Yeah, I know, I know, we're cold. There we go. Okay, so stone, wood, wood, stone, wood. Stone, 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 stone. Yep, perfect. Okay. Whoa, that's one torch down. Right here, let's, uh, let's build this house. And then we'll head over to Rolnica. Um, we could do with building another, um, how much stone can we actually carry? Not that much. Let's put the sticks back because we don't need those. Um, can we take five? Oh, that'll do. And it's not too slow. Um, what was I saying? Go and build a house and then go to Rolnica. Get a new person. And potentially, even though it wants us to build a well and a workshop. I'm tempted by a workshop a little bit. But I am thinking that it would be better if we built another woodshed and got someone else to do more wood cutting because we do seem to be struggling for a decent amount of wood um, at the moment 
that seems to be a problem and we need a lot of wood for the firewood in winter which is uh, quite a high demand um, and then obviously we need it to build houses and other stuff along with um, tools so yeah if we want to have a decent supply then yeah, we need to really um, get more built or more wood which we will do I'm sure I don't think the person that I was eyeing up was um, an excavator though I think he was good at farming so it's not as useful as I would have liked but we've got 166 firewood um, I don't know if that's going to be enough take 25 It'll be a little less encumbered than we were before I think we took 30 uh, last time why did I build it in the uh, resource storage so far away from the housing district just why maybe this area in between these roads can be like the socializing district we could have um, you know, just like seats and uh, campfires and all that stuff around there, which would be quite nice, I think. I don't remember picking up as, as much stone as we have, but oh, to be honest, I could have made them all into uh, stone knives or something, couldn't I? So how much more we need? We need five, nine, nine. So I can start thinking about getting the logs as well. How's he doing? He's fertilizing this field. It's not very useful. I mean, it would be better if you, uh, you know, got to that field and started seeding it, but you know, each to their own. You do you. Um, I can't remember how much stone I said. I'm going to go 10 because I think it was like 9, wasn't it? Um, and let's take 6 logs. We're just over encumbered. We need to bring the planks over as well. So I think it's 24 planks for this level of roof. It's not the best roof. A little bit of a shame, but we just don't have the wood to spare for the roof at the moment. But I think one of these two, I think I'm going to move that house because that house is the oldest. So it's only fair really to move them first. Oh, the log went in there. Boom, and yeah, I want one extra. So it was nine. That is okay. I am happy with that. So, boom, 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 boom. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve logs. We don't have twelve logs. Let's get the axe out. And we can help out a little bit. Are you gonna plow it after or? Oh not. Uh, we need 12 logs, so we want to go deep into the forest here. Find some maple trees. I don't know if I can carry 12 logs. That's the other thing, actually. I think I can only carry about 7. And that's over-encumbered. So let's go for 7 logs. Or 8 logs in. Because it's another maple tree. I'll go over eight logs. Um, da 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 da, boom. Hit, hit, hit. Oh, boom, there we go. Oh, I know, I know, you're cold, I know. Sorry, sorry. Is that. So I can carry eight logs. Can I carry twelve? Is it going to be a bit of a push to carry twelve? Spruce, spruce. 
to put it is. Come on, give me another maple, please. I'm going to have to chop this one down. I got scared then. I thought there was, was something moving and it turns out to be my own hunter. Yeah, I'm carrying too much already now. Oh, that's just slow. Well, I'm going to meet you back at the house. Because I'm carrying these 12 logs and it's going to take a while. So, yeah, see you in a bit. So, um, yeah, what I've done is I, I also brought over the 24 planks. Just dumped them on the floor. Because I thought, you know what? You don't want to see me going back over there to get planks, so I can cut that bit out and just go about and put the logs that I need in. And one perfect amount, and pick up these, and this should then be the perfect amount again to build this house completely, and then we can move one of our existing lot over here. I think it's perfect amount, I hope. Six and six, yeah. The exact amount that we need. And one of our people are going to be very nice and warm in this luxurious stone house. So let's uh, find out who is in this one. By going up here and then putting manage. So it's Dobromir and um... Emerica. So they are not a couple at the moment, so let's move them into here. So they can be nice and happy in there. Um, so let's call that one Emerica Stone. And this one is Leonardo, Leonardo Wood. Empty Wood. Rasamia Wood. So we know who's, the, who's in what. Yeah, so there we go. Rightio. Um, oh, it's going to take ages, isn't it? I mean, I'm going to have to do this myself. I'm going to get the carrot seeds and plant the carrot seeds myself because I don't think he's going to do them. Yeah, so where's my bag? Bag, field, fertilizer, carrots. There we go. And we can't plant all 25, so I don't know why I had to do all 25. Um, but oh well. We can do at least three rows of five. Which is at least something, it's a bit more food. Because uh, otherwise we'll be struggling a bit, having to wait until the end of, um, or the, the start of summer. The fuck was that noise? Weird. Um, yeah, we'd have to wait until summer for, you know, the, the rest of, like, the food, like, the cabbages and all that. Um, oopsie. Actually, did I muck it up? Cabbage, spring to summer, summer to autumn. No, so you can't plant it until spring. So there we go, we've done a bit more planting there of what we can do. Um, let's have a look. So those two are now a bit happier, which is nice. Um, we've got some meat, which we're going to just scoff down. Uh, da 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 da, journal, Dolben Jaeger's story. So yeah, we've got to go back to Nida. Which is fine. We'll, we'll go and do that. Um, oh. 
Little bird trap. Let's arm that again. Let me in, let me in, let me in. Just cook some meat up so we've got some meat for the travel. Or for the journey. Need to get some water and I'm going to head on over. Again, I probably won't take you with me because um, I'll only take you with me if I find something interesting. I doubt I'm going to find anything interesting. I mean, I'll keep an eye out, keep an eye on the weather horizon, uh, weather horizon, etc., etc. But I'm going to make. I'm just going to chop down this, to get some more. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to get water as well, didn't I? Gonna chop this down. Dum dum and dum dum, and I will make four spears. There we go, and walk on down here to get a nice fresh sip of very cold river water. <laughs> um, yeah. So I'll see you over there, um, all the way over there, miles away. But yeah, the end of it. Here we go. Look at this lovely, picturesque place here. It is very, very nice landscape in the uh, in the cold, or in the uh, winter. The other good thing as well is that you can easily see where the stones are, so you can pick up a ton of stones quick and easy. Dum 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 stone 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 and uh, stick so I can make a load of stone knives again so um, they're not they're not exactly a very efficient way of um, gaining money to be honest but I mean we need more money now for taxes in spring we've spent a lot on oh, yep hello um let's get rid of feathers as well we spent a lot on the fertilizer so any amount of money back would be useful um because we would still need some more fertilizer as well uh i find yeah they say i've had man. Oh my, I must send someone promptly. I gave him some med medicine. He should be able to pull through. Shall I say? I gave him some medicine. Thank you very much for the help. We hand with delivery of rye. I don't know when I... Sure, don't worry about it. You're amazing. I know, I know. Here are some kinds for your good help. Thank you all, goodbye. 300 coins. Yes, we need money. I am sorry. I could have said, no, your worker needs it more. Um, no, because I, I need the money. I am sorry. We seem to have someone else. So do we have a nice lady friend as well? Ludwika, who is an extraction level three. So is Odon. Is it Odon that we wanted? I think it was. It's... Uh, Let's get them both. I mean, Ludwika's a little, oh, a little young. Sorry for, um, Ludwika's only eighteen. Odon is nineteen. Uh, not nineteen. Twenty-nine. We'll put them in a house together for now. Um. She's not very good at farming, but he is, so he can go into the barn. No, 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 no. Uh, yeah. Barn as a farmer, please. Ludwika excavation. But for now, let's put her in the hunting lodge. No? Oh, hunting. Oh. Oh. Um. 
Okay, Ludwika, come off. Emerica, you can now switch over to the hunting lodge. Ludwika can go into the woodshed. So at least everyone's got two. Emerica obviously is better than uh, Lumberjack. And we will move her back to Lumberjack probably for now. But yes, we have another two villagers since we're getting them in two. And I tell you what, Ludwika, let's have a small talk and see what she likes. First you're born, then you grow up and learn how to work. You harvest fields, hunt the prey, crop to go, yada yada. And then take a circle of life here. Uh huh. The sooner the season ends, the better. My hands are freezing. I can't concentrate on whatever I cover when the spring comes. It is easy for me to gain others' trust. They know I am a hardworking, reliable companion. Does anyone give you a. I can't force my heart into crafting and just have a routine job. Let's get that out and have another chat. Let's see, romance. Um, it seems very interesting. Work can often get under. What do you do in your spare time? Uh, what's your favourite season of the year? Let's say that. Oh, it's only five. Mm, definitely autumn. That's one of my favourite harvests. Okay. What's your favourite? Well, okay, I wouldn't, but now I don't know. I just wish to be happy. I'm always eager to learn new things. Do you have any advice? Lots of. Go with that. That's another five, so it's all right. It's all right. Have a look. What's your favourite food? When I first arrived in Bay, made the making. How do you like it? I swear we have no. Okay, she doesn't like the weather. That's another five. Okay. Let's do farewell and F five it just in case we muck it up. And um, no. Okay, we're we've uh, done enough. We've got fifteen percent affection on Ludwika and she is our um, first choice of being a wonderful wife I think she is 18 years old um, yes yeah, 18 years old so she's a, a great age for us definitely uh, better than the 29 year old that we currently have her with so now we need to head all the way over to Gustavia. It was a very uneventful walk, um, and I expect it to be a very uneventful walk again. So I'm going to leave it here and um, join you either in the next episode or at the end of this episode, depending how long it's going to take me to get over there. Probably going to be at the end or at the uh, start of it next episode where we will be delivering the crate of rye to Gustavia. I hear uh, I hear bad bad sounds. I hear bad, bad sounds. Yeah, get away. Get away, you. Okay. Don't know if it's going to come back. I think it died, but there seems to be more. So let's see if we can, we can get the spears off this one and quickly harvest. <laughs> quickly harvest before the other wolf comes back, because we are a little bit hurt. I'm not sure how I'm going to get the other wooden spear, which uh, seems to be going in the ground. But yeah, we have protected our young lady. We've protected her from the wolf. 
That wolf could have been very dangerous for her. Uh, aren't you happy? Yeah? Uh, did I do a good job? No? Fine. Hmm. I thought I did a good job. Anyway, yep, yeah, that's, uh, that's enough for this episode. And I will see you in the next episode over at Gustovia. Thank you for watching. And see you in the next episode. Bye. 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 Bye.